transaction between the buyer and the seller just by a verbal agreement without writing i wouldn't recommend at the time that we're living right now i would not recommend to do a verbal agreement but rather you have a piece of an agreement on a piece of paper where you have on a memorandum from the buyer and seller and also if the agreement is not there this should be at least the one or the two witnesses the people who speaks true who are has a taqwa and who are a god fearing uh so then you can do the transaction but having a verbal transaction there has many many conflict conflicts and there's are too many uh, problems on the world has been seen just based on a verbal because one party says this and the one party says that but rather you have a piece of paper that the uh, the agreement has to be written if there is no paper or the pen according to the hadith then you have to have a uh, witnesses and those witnesses should be a uh, truthful at least the one uh not one but rather two or three and they should be a uh, very truthful and they should be very uh and honest in speaking and they should be uh witnessing this type of transaction between the buyer and the seller then you are able to do that but writing just you being alone with the buyer and seller you're just doing a verbal uh agreement i would not uh encourage that and i would totally discourage it but rather you have to have everything input on a piece of paper or you have to have a <laughs>